Hi there, thank you for watching my channel. Today I have an elf haul for you. For you. Um, I'm going to do it in three different sections because I want to talk about each thing properly. Um, I'm basically not going to ramble on, I'm going to tell you exactly what it says on the back of the packaging for each product. And that way you can get a full idea of what it's for and what it does. And then I've kind of got it documented as well, so then I can then go back and watch the videos and know what it's about and what it's for type of thing until I get used to using them. Um, so in this one I'm going to do eyes and nails. So I'm just going to shut up now and get on and show you exactly what I got. The first, I want to do nails first and the first one I want to show you is this one here which is my Mod Mauve, 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 Mauve. <clears throat> Just looks like that. It's kind of like a mauve kind of colour. <laughs> no, it's um really nice muted um colour. It hasn't got no shine in. It's just it's not a matte, obviously, but um it's just a really nice. dusky kind of colour and then the next one I got was this one here it is Metal Madness and if you can see there it is kind of like a gunmetal colour with loads of different shimmering it's absolutely gorgeous colour and that was that one there these are all 150 by the way just in case you didn't know which I'm sure you probably do by now and the next one I got was Smoky Brown um, apparently this is kind of a new colour that's just come out. It's like a really nice mushroomy kind of colour. <clears throat> and the next one I got was um, just like a matte finish one. And it is really, really good. Um, the only thing I have with it is that... Uh, is, does it have a name? Just called matte finisher. The only, thing, the only problem I have with it, um, I've tried it once. It's not really a problem, but when you go to take it off, it takes a lot longer to get it off than what it would do if you didn't have it on. Um, I don't know if that's what matte colours, matte finishes do. But, yeah, anyway. <laughs> and then the next colour that I got was... I can't even read this. My eyes are so bad. You all gonna... Oh, Twinkle. That's what it is. And just kind of like a glitter top coat. And it's really nice and shiny. Sorry about that light there. Just see that there. And then I got copper, which is a new and improved formula, it says on the bottle. And as you can see there, it's kind of like a rose gold copper colour. <laughs> That's all I can see about it, really. Most of these, are f I mean, everything here is basically first impressions. Um, I only got the box today. And I did try, obviously, the matte one on the colour I've got on now. Um, and this one here is nude. Apparently this one takes quite a long time to dry. Um, it's just like a kind of really light pink, creamy type of colour. And the last one that I got was lilac, which I thought would be really nice for spring and it's a bit darker than what it's showing up there on the screen um, but it's a really nice colour and I tried it on my nails and I really do like it so I'll tell you a bit more about that sometime and then I picked up these here which is just everyone knows what they are eyelash curlers um, they come with a little guard like that to keep them together and they come with an extra plastic bit Sorry, I don't know if you can see it rolling around just down there. That's an pl extra plastic bit for when that one gets grubby, but in all reality it shouldn't really get grubby because you're supposed to use these before you even put mascara or anything on your eyelashes. I just suppose maybe it's in time it kind of wears down, I don't know. And then I got, I'm really big on my eyebrows at the minute because um, just my eyebrows frame me face and make it look pretty, I suppose. Um, so I picked up this here, which is in the shade Ash. I think it's Ash. 
yeah, ash and it just looks like this here as you can see I used it today and that is the gel and that is the ash powder it is quite light but I mean as you can see it still shows up so it's not as, as dark as I would have wanted it um, but it did look kind of darker than this on the website and that's just the little double ender brush you get with it and I'll quickly tell you what it says. Um, it creates brows that are fuller, thicker and more defined. Shapes and sets your eyebrows. and um, Gives lasting colour definition to a naturally beautiful look. For a natural beautiful look. Yeah. Um, use a pigmented brow gel to define and shape the brows with an angle brush for precise... Start again. Precise lines. Set the colour in with the brow powder and fill it in with the blending brush for a natural finished look. So, and that's the package when it came in. That was the studio line, which was £3.50. Um, what's that doing over there? Get down there. And then the next thing I got was um, the eyebrow treatment team, which is basically a double ended one like this, and on one side it has. A spoolie and on the other end it has the treat which is just um, like a brush applicator a stiff brush applicator and that is in the shade light by the way this end here and it says um, create manicured and style brows that are beautiful and defined treat your eyebrows with a regrowth fitment infused gel and um, tame your eyebrows with a fibre enhanced mascara formula for fuller and more natural looking brows and the directions is use the tame mascara on your eyebrows to define and keep them in place which is obviously the colour side um, for a more, more fuller and more tailored look and then you use the treat gel to condition, repair and restore the eyebrows and you can use it alone or underneath makeup okay <laughs> And then the last thing that I got in this section is the eyebrow lifter and filler. And that is in shade ivory light. No, in shade light. Sorry, which is this one here. I'm not going to, I mean, I'm going to swatch anything because I just, I'm not. That, you get a little shot on that. And then on the other side is the thing there. And you just like put this underneath to... What do you call it? Lift your eyebrow. And this one says, um, creates polished and defined brows for a flawless and fuller look. Fills in sparse areas for a more natural brow, which I definitely need, because mine are just non-existent. Um, directions, use the, li the lift pencils, sheer light reflecting pigments as an arch support under the brows to enhance and outline the shape. And then you trace a, s a curved line underneath the eyebrow and blend down into the brow bone. Um, use the fill pencil to shade in the eyebrow, then blend in the natural shape of the brow for more defined lines. Now, really, I should not—I should not be reading something. I should be basically telling you it. But um, this is the first time I've ever bought anything from Elf, so I don't know anything about it. So I'm kind of learning. So as I'm learning, I'm kind of telling you. Um, maybe you have bought stuff before, maybe you haven't, but I'm just kind of showing you how to use it properly, maybe. Um, if you want any, like, a review or a demonstration or anything like that, just please let us know in the comments box and I will gladly do one for anything for you. Oh dear. Thank you very much for watching and I shall see you all again soon. Thanks guys, bye.